Hello family, welcome back to my channel and happy Valentine's Day! I'm a Christian content creator based in Lagos, Nigeria. I'm going to be sharing a quick word with you today and it is titled, True Love Will Find You. So, um... Before we get into the word, let's just say a quick prayer. Our Father and our God, I want to thank you for gathering us together in your presence again. I want to thank you for being so loving, so kind, so gentle, so generous, so faithful towards us. Thank you because your love saves us. Thank you for redeeming us. Thank you for finding us, meeting each and every one of us at our particular point of need. At the end of the day, may all power, glory, and adoration be brought unto your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. So today's word is actually from the Psalms. It is from Psalm 136, 137, and 138. Please read the chapters for yourself. Get your own fresh revelations. Get your own fresh revelation from the word. But um, today's title is actually from my personal experience. It's not directly in the word. But let me read the word and then I'll share the background behind the title. So Psalm 136 says, Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to the God of gods. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to the Lord of lords. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who alone does mighty miracles. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who made the heavens so skillfully. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who placed the earth among the waters. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who made the heavenly lights. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who made the sun to rule the day and the moon and stars to rule the night. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who brought Israel out of Egypt. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who acts with a strong hand and powerful arm. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who parted the Red Sea. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who led Israel safely through. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who hurled Pharaoh and his army into the Red Sea. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to him who led his people through the wilderness. His faithful love endures forever. Are <laughs> you picking up on the theme? <laughs> Give thanks to him who struck down mighty kings. His faithful love endures forever. He remembers us in our weakness. His faithful love endures forever. He saves us from our enemies. His faithful love endures forever. He gives food to every living thing. His faithful love endures forever. Give thanks to the God of heaven. His faithful love endures forever. And that was literally the first chapter I saw when I opened my Bible this morning. Y'all know how I do it. Lord, please lead me to a word. And then I just randomly open my Bible. And God found me. Like God's love just met me right where I was and led me to this word that just encouraged me to just be grateful, to even know him, to even have a relationship with him and to have a love that will endure forever like this is the only love that will literally last like even if you have the best husband in the world he's still an imperfect man and he's still gonna fail you and his love is still gonna disappoint you sometimes it might not be enough but god's love is faithful and it will endure forever like i think of all my years as a lost sheep and his love was still with me enduring forever and will still be with me enduring forever and then in chapter 138, it says, I give you thanks, O Lord, with all my heart. I will sing your praises. I will praise your name for your unfailing love and faithfulness. For your promises are backed by all the honor of your name. As soon as I pray, you answer me. You encourage me by giving me strength. And that's literally what he did today. Like He just found me, just met me right where I was and encouraged me and gave me strength to just know that God is faithful and God loves me and his love will endure forever. So the verse, the last verse in chapter 138 was just really the summary of it all. The Lord will work out his plans for my life. For your faithful love, O Lord, endures forever. So today, if you are feeling a bit lonely, if you're not feeling the Valentine feels, can you just like turn yourself 
your emotions your eyes your ears your heart everything in you that you can control turn it over to jesus and he will fill you with his love he will drown you with his love like he will surround you with his love he will strengthen you with his love he will encourage you with his love and he will prove to you that his faithful love will never fail you it will endure forever and he will work out his plans for your life i love you if nobody has told you they love you today i love you and most importantly god loves you jesus loves you and i pray that you feel his love today and forever all right see you tomorrow baby you can